Okay, welcome to our tutorial for adding items to the notice board on Leicestershire Villages. And you'll find it in the local posting section of the site on the left hand side. And if I click on the link, it's effectively the classified ad section of Leicestershire Villages. So you can put items for sale on here, you can celebrate someone's special birthday or anniversary. It's been used um, to reunite lost cat with their family. It's um, used for selling cars, swapping council houses. Uh, it's even available for local businesses to advertise local job vacancies. Once again, it's completely free to use this. And to add anything to the notice board, you simply click on the Add New button. And it really is the same kind of form that you'll see for anything else in the local posting section. So in this example, I'm going to put an item uh, which is a car for sale. So for my subject, I'm going to type in car for sale. And you don't need to include a picture, but it really does um, make it easier for people to get an idea of what you're actually selling. So if I click on the browse button, it's exactly the same way as adding an attachment to an email. And it allows you to search through the hard drive of your computer. And I've got a, an image located in here, so I'll choose the car. Now, it, if you leave this button ticked, it will automatically resize your image to fit on the screen and it defaults to 200 pixels by 200 pixels. You can change that if you want to, but it really is best to leave that as it is. Your description is basically uh, the information about that particular car. You can either type it in directly or I'm going to paste that in from something I've typed into Word earlier but make sure you include contact details in there and as much information as you can. You can choose to link to another website or another part of Leicestershire Villages if you want to. And there's also a space to add up to two um, files as attachments. It could be <coughs> um, a video file, a Word document, Excel spreadsheet, any type of file can go in here. And what I'm gonna use this for is to add the full size image for people to have a look at this particular car. So I'm going to click on the browse button and it's exactly the same way that we added our picture. We'd be able to have a look on the hard drive of our computer and I'm going to add exactly the same picture again. The difference is that this won't resize the picture. Now if you do add an attachment you will need to include a name just so the user will know what they're downloading so I'm going to put the name in as view full size image okay and I'm going to go ahead and click on save and you should see that our item goes straight onto the site and it appears in pink because it's not been approved uh, to go live on the site yet it's waiting to be checked by a moderator first so you'll notice that the image has been resized to fit on the screen but there's a link here to be able to view the full size image and if we click on that it shows us a full size image for people to have a look at to get a better idea of what that car is and that's probably the best way of selling an item on Leicestershire Villages and what we will do if you put an item for sale we'll cascade it into every village and town in the county now the thing with new uh, items on the notice board that they'll remain on there for 30 days and then they'll be automatically deleted. So if you find that your item uh, is still for sale and hasn't been sold, you can just go in and resave it and it will last for another 30 days. So that's really all there is to add in items to the notice board. Once again, it's, it's completely free to do, uh, very simple. Um, and it's a, a very easy way of you uh, putting items for sale on the site, for example. So why not go and have a go?